Hello, everyone, and welcome. I'm Rachel Craw, one of the National Account Managers at C1Gov. Recently, we had the incredible opportunity to be part of the 2023 Alamo Ace, hosted by the Alamo Chapter of AFCIA at the beautiful La Contera Resort in San Antonio, Texas. During this event, I had the pleasure of interviewing Josh Foster from Siena, a prominent figure in the federal sector known for his expertise in optical technology and digital transformation. Our conversation provided insight into Siena's contributions supporting the federal sector. In our interview, Josh shared his experiences from the event and delved into a significant case study that Siena and C1Gov deployed together in the federal sector. So without further ado, let's jump into this insightful conversation where Josh sheds light on these critical topics. Can you give us an overview of what the FCA Alamo Ace event is about? FCA Alamo Ace is really about bringing together the leaders of both the uh, both industry and defense uh, into a collaborative environment where we can spawn ideas off of each other. And so it's that cross-pollination gives us the ability to reconnect with our partners in defense and in industry. And, uh, in industry. How is Siena involved in this year's Alamo Ace event? Uh, Siena's platinum sponsor, and uh, we also host a booth here. So it's a chance for us to meet new folks uh, and uh, speak with other leaders and uh, work with uh, work with our existing partners. How does Siena? support the federal sector, especially in terms of its technology. Uh, for many years, Siena has been involved as the backbone of DISA's optical core, uh, and we've also uh, embarked upon a number of network modernizations across DOD. So it's a chance to see where the direction is heading uh, within the defense industry uh, and allows us to make new partnerships as well. Can you share a success story of how Siena has made a significant impact in the federal sector? Uh, yes, uh, Vandenberg Space Force Base is one of our largest projects to date uh, within the sector and it's helped us to modernize the infrastructure within that base and has set a, a model for us to grow other bases as well so we've been able to create that and modernize the the uh, infrastructure pulling out a lot of the old equipment that has been ma manufactured discontinued but at the same time creating new capabilities and new uh, opportunities for the tenants on the on the various uh, bases that we've been involved in this event brought together leaders and experts in cyberspace, multi-domain operations, and military ISR operations, creating a dynamic platform for discussion, innovation, and strategic insights. 